Hello, welcome to Sunday weigh-ins. Every Sunday, I'd like to weigh in to tell myself I'm trying. Oh, I want to be losing weight. Um, spoiler alert: this uh, this one's bad. This is this is not a great weigh-in. Um, I'm not sure what what's going on here. I just woke up this morning with a sore across my face and a blood smatter on the on the wall next to my bed. So I don't know if I just like flinched in my sleep and smacked myself in the head overnight or something. I don't know. It's weird. Here, let me get to the, the weigh-in. And, uh... Yeah, that sucked. Um, waist this week is at uh, 58 and a half inches, which is up from 57 inches last week, which is up one and a half inches. <laughs> Wait, this week is at 349.4 which is up from 342 last time, which is up 7.4 pounds. 7.5 pounds in a week. Damn. Uh, BMI this week is at 44.9, which is up from 43.9, which is up one one whole BMI. Uh, waist to height ratio is at 79.1, which is up from 77 even last time, which is up 2.1 on the Waist to height ratio. Yeah, that sucked. I fell off the wagon this weekend. I had quite a bender this weekend, actually. I don't know if this is just excuse or not, but uh, on uh, Thursday morning, uh, there was an update to my computer. It was saying the the Wi-Fi adapter for the computer, my computer uh, needed an update. Um, quite some time ago, uh, the Ethernet port on my computer went out, so uh, I had a, I bought a Ethernet adapter and Thursday morning uh, the Avast driver update uh, said there was an update to the Wi-Fi uh, adapter and it said it won't work proper it might not work properly while it's doing the update and then like a couple seconds later it had a uh, thing saying it can't do the update because it's not connected to the internet yeah I think the uh, Avast updater breaks the Wi-Fi adapter so I had to reinstall a, a Amazon on my phone to uh, buy a new Wi-Fi adapter. Side tangent is uh, I do not, I I am very not happy with the vast at all. Uh, was it last year? It had suddenly charged my account even though I canceled uh, for the anti soft anti um, the the security software. It charged my account even though I had. Uh, charged my banking account even though I had canceled all my uh, accounts with them because somehow I had signed up twice for it and uh, sun's coming up <laughs> but yeah anyway um so I wasn't doing the uh, the vlog for a uh, blog for a couple days because I I do have the blogging app on my phone but typing in on the phone is just not the same as typing on the computer so I haven't, didn't do the blog, so I wasn't really paying attention to what I was eating. Although, all the food I ate this weekend was the food I have in my refrigerator. I was doing pretty good on that, but was not doing good on this. So, it's fascinating that three days off of the blog equals 6.6 uh, 6 pounds in three days because I just wasn't doing the blog. I don't know if that's... Another thing that's, I don't know if it's causation or correlation. If I said anything this morning when I woke up, uh, went to bed about one o'clock, like I usually do, but I woke up at 5.30 just, okay, I'm awake now. Every single muscle in my body is stiff and sore. I feel like I'm walking around on stilts. Going back to work this week, I uh, had paid time off the last week and this previous week, uh, using up the last of my, uh, uh, paid time off before the holiday starts and uh, sitting around all week is and uh, drinking beer for the last three days uh, going back to work is going to suck today <laughs> um, <clears throat> but good news is uh, I did sign up for a uh, uh, clinic here in town uh, just did the uh, sign up and uh, questionnaire yesterday uh, so uh, I haven't had a response from that because it's you know weekend but getting <laughs> health checkups, that's going to be, that's probably going to be good for me. Um, 
my last doctor was a pediatrician. Um, last, last time I had a physical was in middle school to join the track team, which I quit in like a month. I'm not sure if, uh, it, it, it says it's low carb, uh, uh, but, uh, I don't know if it's, I don't know, does, uh, I think, I'm pretty sure alcohol interrupts, uh, ketosis, even though it, it's low carb, it's doing something in your blood that, uh, that interrupts the process of ketosis. But, uh, that, that's me come thinking of something when I had about four hours of sleep <laughs> and uh, wake up with very sore. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm not sure. I signed up for the clinic uh, over the weekend, so I don't know if uh, this week, I don't know if it's going to have a, an appointment this week. They said they would uh, part of the, the sign up process is to uh, fill out the questionnaires and they'll call me back in three or four business days, uh, one to three business days. So, um, I don't know if they'll have, uh, enough time to set up an appointment this week. <laughs> Next week I, I, uh, have, uh, <laughs> I, I work on Tuesday and I'm getting new tires for my car. Thanks, uh, stepdad. And uh, then I'm off Saturday, and they're not open Saturdays. And uh, the week after that, I think I think I'm free the week after that. So if if I don't get an appointment this week, it'll be two weeks before I get available for a, a checkup. So um, just uh, seeing seeing the spreadsheet here that's uh, up ten pounds for the month. And up four pounds for the the years. Uh, wow. Uh, yeah. Yeah. The uh, daily blog really does keep me on track on the, the quit quitting beer. Um, uh, been pretty good at eating keto uh, the the ketogenic food that I have in my refrigerator. Uh, pretty good at not buying anything other than, you know. <sighs> but. Uh, I think that's it. Um, just, uh, just wish I'd been better on the beer, and uh, probably should have been good on moving uh, more this week. Um, although uh, I'm not sure how much uh, move more, eat less really, uh, really works. Other than you know, um, I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it out there because this is a ramble blog. So anyway. Um, like, share, and subscribe, and all that fun stuff, and uh, have a nice day.